please return to the medical bay. You may further injure yourself by walking. I heard you the first five times. Now be silent. I have an outpost to defend. So, you made it past the pass in the mountains. I'm surprised the Hailstorm Brotherhood let anyone through. Your old friend is alive and well. Hoth is turning our way. Revar. It is too long since I've heard from him. Apparently not doing so well he could send a fighting force. We've been cut off from the other outpost by the Hellstorm Brotherhood. A cult of madmen in the White Moor Pirates. You see this wound? Dressed it with seasonings from the rations when we ran out of Colto. In a few days, we'll be eating boot leather to survive. There's no glory in dying. Can you make it back to another outpost? No retreating. I've spent too long in this ice patch to be driven off by some half-dressed freaks. Besides, they track us and attack. The Hailstorm Brotherhood are lying in wait in a pass between hills near here. You may be able to find them and wipe them out. Could you do this? Could you face the Brotherhood? They'll never know what hit them. Good. Bleed them white, so that any who find the bodies know the might of the Empire. Then, when you have the bodies piled... Ugh, curse it. Another stitch. Sir, I did say you need to be on bed rest. Very well. The Brotherhood like to use downed speeders as bait. They should be easy enough to find. Good hunting. Burn a hole through that wall and feed in the camera. There is no more Davos. I did not invite servants. I act in the Admiral's name. I'll show you. Getting audio only. Can you see anything? That's Captain Firth, one of the Admiral's men. I don't know the pirate. Huh. Begin playback. Ashok the Unyielding, I am honored by your invitation. I am Admiral Davos, and I fought in the Battle of Hoth. Unlike my peers, I was left to the icy wastes. For six months I wandered the wreckage. As I lost my vitality, I found many items of great value. Weapons, artifacts, even a Republic shuttle full of secrets. I hid them in the Starship graveyard, so that I might one day claim my prize. Today's that day. Give us safe passage into the Starship graveyard, and we'll all leave rich. Hey, Agent? Might want to see this. Is there a problem? Shaggy Man. Hey, ugly. Gonna make a towel out of you. Situation under control. What happened with the meeting? We cut a deal, sir. The pirates are going to escort Admiral Davos to his treasure, but they outlined their route. I think we know where they're heading. That Republic shuttle he talked about, did it come up again? Just the part about it being full of secrets. I think the Admiral likes playing games. The Aristocra and I can meet you at the edge of the Starship Graveyard. There's an Imperial outpost there. Zagano can fill you in. He likes you, by the way. And we can plan a final approach. Temple out. Come on out, I'll show you. 
show you my gun. I found the Hailstorm Brotherhood you spoke of. The pass is clear. Is that so? Glad to hear their bodies are finally getting colder. Those maniacs have laughed at us for far too long. But here's something they don't know. We found out where they hide. The Hailstorm Brotherhood make camp in an open-air fortress cut out of the ice, not far from here. I guess caves were too easy. They obey what their beloved Master Sav tells them to. He's their legend. A man who can survive anywhere. Kill the head of their little personality cult, and the body will fall apart. He's got Master in his name. Is he on the Jedi Council? Or is it just a nickname? We assume he doesn't use the Force, or else he wouldn't be able to teach his skills to so many. He's tapped into something in the human body which makes him and his followers plenty dangerous. If you go into that ice fortress, don't give him any chances. I'll make sure there are no survivors. Good. Now to work. Master Sav is responsible for this. For me. For my men. When you kill him, you let him know what a mistake he made leaving me alive. It seems you have some skill, stranger. You are not the effete little warriors they usually send our way. I suppose you were also the one who slew so many in the White Ridge Hills. Your men are dead, buried in the snow. I am here. I had expected more hatred from a foe we have beaten and starved. But perhaps you are not from the outpost, are you? No, them I know. You are something different. You do as I do. You compete to out-compete. For you, I have a challenge. What sort of challenge? I speak of the crypt, where only the truly strong dare fight. Its fog will soak you through in seconds and steal all warmth from your body. It is then we discover who we truly are. Join me in battle, one against one fighting for our lives. Nothing is more pure in this world or any other. Then we will meet in this crypt. Yes, and there you will meet Oblivion. Master Sav. Master Sav. You've killed him. You can't say he wasn't asking for it. Yes, I heard him rant, as he so often does. Master Sav believed nothing could kill him. We walked in his footsteps, testing the limits of the body. But it's clear from your ordeal in the crypt that you surpassed him. Do I have to take on the rest of you crazies? No. Your potential is rare and inspiring. I would no sooner destroy you than tear apart a priceless painting. With the proper technique, you might resist the elements as we do. I would be honored for you to learn from me. If you feel you can teach me... Sit with me then. Close your eyes and breathe. Each of us has a fire burning within our body. If tended to, it can blaze hot enough to protect us. see the signs in you. With practice, the core will hold no danger to you. Now I will gather the rest of the brotherhood and leave this planet. If you see a Hailstorm brother from this moment on, they are not loyal to me. Deal with them as you see fit. 
Master Sav is dead, and his successor is leaving for another planet. I trust this will help. You are a drink of water to a dying man. Yes, yes, it will help us greatly. I'm contacting Dawnbase. They should be able to bring us supplies if the Brotherhood is truly leaving the mountain passes. But Master Sav was just one of many. Soon we'll go after the big game. Boss Undro, Elis Tarn, and the other Whitemoor kingpins. Never heard of them. That's how they like it. Low profile. But intelligence has worked up a list of their names. Admiral Holtz is going to order an attack. Fixer 308 at Zerik Outpost would have the details. The outpost's in the ship graveyard, prime Whitemoor turf. If anyone's come up with a way to hammer the pirates right off this rock, the Fixer would know. Give her a try. In conclusion, Admiral, this seems like the most opportune window we'll get. All I need is the go-ahead. At least with my approval, Fixer. You may brief the volunteers and commence with the mission. Over and out. Ah, there you are. I'm Fixer 308. We've been planning for your arrival ever since we heard about your success with the Tals. What do you have for me? We've been hitting the White Maw hard lately. Enough so that they've called a meeting of their gangs. The loss of a power station was a bigger blow than we thought. Every one of their gangs will be represented. We intend to get you into that meeting and have you capture or kill everyone present. The hard part is getting there. Do you have a plan in mind? The shuttles of the leader's trusted captains will have the meeting's coordinates programmed into the Nava computers. What you'll need to do is find a lieutenant with a shuttle, kill him, and get his access card to steal his ship. Once you get access to the shuttle, fly it to their hideout, track down the gang leaders, and take them out. Can you do that? Shall I do this with or without a blindfold? Here's a dossier on the leaders to terminate so you'll be able to identify them. Our psych profiles indicate that, given the opportunity, some of them may surrender. It's up to you. Lastly, if you find an opportunity to search their files, take it. There's no telling what secrets these malcontents have hidden away. We'd be buried alive by the third marker. Bring up the Northern Passage. Let me see. She's here, sir. I'm aware of that. Resume planning. Glad to see you, Agent. Thanks to your surveillance, we have a lock on Admiral Davos's destination. He and his men are being escorted to a crashed Republic Super Dreadnought in the heart of the Starship Graveyard. His horde is there. Have some faith in me, Aristocra. I won't disappoint you. I promise you are not in question. The horde is sealed in the tertiary launch bay, protected by an army of White Moor pirates. Sorry I'm late. Did I miss the bad news? There's no other kind. Lovely. Go on. This isn't a one-squad operation. The Defense Force will join you for the assault. I'll take any help you can give. I suggest a two-pronged approach. You slip past the pirates on the Super Dreadnought and deactivate the blast doors. That'll let my team in. We can rendezvous at the launch bay. We'll be your backup. Skirmish tactics, blaster rifles, and electrostaves only. We don't want to damage the Horde. Understood, sir. We'll stay on our toes. Dismissed, all of you. It's time to move. Good luck, sir. I'll see you at the Dreadnought. One last thing. I've made it clear that I admire your skill. But more than that, you embody the red flame. The discipline, cunning, and courage all Chiss aspire to. I never thought to see it in a woman from another world. Isn't there anything else you want to say? Before I risk my life? There's nothing more I want to say. It's time. Admiral Davos is on the move, and my forces are waiting. If all goes well, perhaps we'll meet again.
We've heard enough alarms. The time has come to move our base of operations to Lorimar. Why go to Lorimar when nothing can reach us here? The guards will handle whatever intruders at the door. I wonder if you'll be so confident in another minute. I don't know who you think you are, but you made a bad mistake opening this door. I offer refuge for anyone who leaves the White Moor now. All others will die. What, no one? I'll accept. This isn't going to end well. Don't be naive! It's a trick! Naive is following you and thinking we're going to defeat the Empire. So be it, traitor. I did what you wanted. There were complications, but it's been handled. I was dreading telling the rest of intelligence that I'd gotten you killed. So the White Maw finally falls. I wonder, was this the nerve center of their operation, or are there valuables hidden elsewhere? I found a place called Lorimar in their databanks. It's likely their stash is there. Lorimar. I wonder if that has to do with the inventor, Lorimar. He was quite a droid maker before he vanished a decade or so back. We should probably send a salvage team to investigate. But seeing as you trusted me with this information, I think I'll mark the area as unsecured until you're finished with it. That way the reclamation service doesn't get first crack. That's kind of you. Don't mention it. Especially not where internal security might be listening. Thank you. I doubt I could have trusted someone else to bring this operation to a close. It's okay. I'm a member of the White Maw. No exceptions are made for White Maw members. Step away from the cases. Neutralization mode engaged. Probably crack a planet with that thing. following. Blasters and flame projectors. Alright, keep them at a distance. Sir, enemies in pursuit. More expected. Bit of a nightmare, but we'll hold them off. What happened to the Admiral? Admiral Davos and his horde should be down that corridor somewhere. 
quite possibly with his escort. Eleven, twelve more, marauders and scourge. Saganu is holding our escape route outside. We'll keep the pirates off your back. Do what you came to do. Admiral, intruder! Target her, but do not fire. The Cypher agent lives. I wondered what became of you. What do we have here? Blasters, armor, colto, credits, Sith relics? The ships downed in the battle carried many valuables. I did not discriminate. I waited years to return to Hoth and reclaim my retirement funds. My superiors were never to know. We should take her now. Silence. You complicated matters. Forced us to part ways with the Empire. But this can be mended. Tell me what you desire. No bribes, Admiral. All I want is your surrender. A woman of principles. How admirable. Kill her. Codename Legate to Hunter. I have located the Starbreeze. You're a great cattle. Fiery as always. Get that shuttle running and rendezvous at these coordinates. Hunter, out. Sir, pirates are down, but I'm the only one left. We need to get moving. Have you been injured? Scratches, sir. Deep scratches. Force trick saved my life. Hate to say it, but we'll need help flying this thing. Half the systems are frozen. We'll discuss this later. Get inside the Starbreeze now. Understood, sir. Nice landing. Let's take a look. Solid body, not a scratch on her. And she came with my shuttle? What's her name? Ensign Rena Temple, sir. Just expansionary defense force. Of course. Minder 17, Imperial Intelligence. Excellent work, both of you. I couldn't have done any of this without her. I praise. Maybe she deserves a promotion. I'll fly the shuttle to its final destination. You can take my ride home. Ensign, why don't you and Kaleo run a systems check? I need a minute with the agent. I'll chisel the ice off the pilot seat for you. Arden Cold will be happy. But the girl, we agree she needs to die, right? That's unnecessary. She knows better than to reveal classified intelligence. Maybe I like to be careful. Look, you've worked with her. You've bonded with her. Fine. I'm not heartless. Maybe she'll even be useful. You want her to live? You take responsibility. Stash her on your ship. She doesn't talk to anyone. Doesn't learn about the SIS. What sort of person would subject her to that? A merciful one? Just to be sure, though, I'm putting a command in your brain. Keyword, onomatophobia. If Raina Temple becomes a threat to our mission, or leaves your supervision, 
You will kill her. You won't have a choice. Sir, Minder 17 told me about the transfer. I'm... a little surprised. If Intelligence wants me out of the GIST Defense Force, though, I won't argue. Nice as it would have been to pack an overnight bag. I know it's sudden. You'll have to manage as best you can. Don't get me wrong, it's a fantastic opportunity. My father would love this. But if I can ask, why do you want me here? You're versatile, capable, and young enough to learn. You could be a brilliant operative. Really? Well, maybe it's time for a career change after all. You're cute. We're going to a cantina and you're getting me so many free drinks. I'll try to earn my keep. Hey, Agent. I'm grabbing this ride. Race you back to the ship. I went to the pirate's hideout. I found this neural chipset for a battle droid. I think Lorimar designed it. Well, the stamp seems consistent with his work. Wait, it's brilliant. He solved the traditional limitations of a chipset brain. Hold on a moment, I need to make a call. Admiral, we've recovered a battle droid neural chipset from the White Moor. It's the advancement we've been waiting for. From the White Moor? What are they doing with tech like that? They had it hidden in the last known location of the inventor Lorimar. Lorimar? That would make sense. His robotics always were top-notch. It's a quad-photonic neural chipset, Admiral. If you put this in a battle droid, it'll think on its feet better than most humans. It could change the course of the war. For someone who dropped off the map, Lorimar's work still seems cutting edge. Completely. We'll get this to the space station at once. I'll alert the reclamation service to the Lorimar area. There's no telling what else might be there. As for you, I take a well-earned vacation. Somewhere warm. <laughs>